Put your predictions down right now, right down on the table, right down in the chat. One, Boba Fett wins. Two, Luke wins. Put your prediction down of this whole, of this game. And then we're going to do another prediction for the next game. Actually, for the whole match. Let's do it for the whole match. Boba Fett versus EC, uh, ECL Boba Fett versus looks like Green Command, Big Base, Luke. We're getting uh, some voters saying L Boba. A lot of people saying Boba, Cthulhu, Kawaii. Oh my god, I've opened 126 packs now. <laughs> no Vader, one Boba. <laughs> For you, my brother. All right, guys, I see an ad. I see an ad in my Twitch. I'm going to wait a little bit before we start the game. We're going we're gonna to allow these predictions to flow through. And just give us two seconds, guys. The, the, uh, uh, we'll start right after the ad. We'll start right after the ad, guys. Looks like there's a second here. <laughs> oh man, we're kind of enticing our, our, our viewers to subscribe. Uh, I'll, I'll take off my clothes. No, no, I'm not going to do that. Hey, anyways, we are about to finish, guys. We're, well, I'm excited, guys. I'm excited for this uh, finals. Luke is a really strong deck. I mean, look how strong it performed in this tournament. After this, we're actually going to look at the top 16. Then we're going to end the stream, guys. So stay tuned with us. We're going to look at every single card in the top 16. So stay tuned for sure. It's going to be exciting. Do you have a Twitch? Yes, yes. We're actually streaming on Twitch. It's called Manar Plays. I'm going to send you guys a Twitch right now. Manar Plays. Yeah. <clears throat> and... Man, still ads? Holy moly. What the fuck? I'm going to cancel these ads. Oh, there it is. It's done. All right, guys. Let's jump right in. Boba versus Luke. About to start ECL Boba. I think I'm going to be putting it for... Honestly, Luke should have a really strong matchup. Because Boba has no way to remove the Luke. But let's see if Boba can go wide. Maybe he doesn't even care about the Luke. I don't know. Because Boba can just drop down some Sentinels. And can slow down the Luke. Even if you go for all those shields. You cannot deal all your damage onto my base because of the, my Sentinels. So let's see how Boba wants to do it. Uh, I'd be about that life if I didn't drop over 500 on this game and managed to open no vendors, no vaders. Cthulhu, I know what you mean, man. You know what I did? I already dropped $300 or $400 on the game, but not single box. I'm just buying singles. <laughs> and they're going up in price, so I'm just struggling here. But I got my Avengers. I just need one more super laser and one... Ev oh, there's Darth Vader. And the collection is done. Is Boba really that overpowered? Like what everyone is saying, Boba won this whole tournament. He's... He's not, I wouldn't say he's overpowered, but his mid game is some of the, one of the best mid games and a lot of people have not figured out how to deal with it. And then he can, he can turn his mid game to a really strong late game with Darth Vader green. So that's the only reason. Wow, look at that. Amazing play there by the Boba, keeping his Viper alive. Uh, I think this is shoot first is what he played, giving it plus one, plus one, and then, or plus two, plus two, and then allowing it to stay alive. Wow, really strong there. I don't know how, how amazing that's going to do against this Luke, but keeping your board, uh, your ground units on, on ground, obviously, is going to be very helpful. Let's see what Luke wants to do here. Luke has a bunch of li lightsabers, I think, and also we see a regional governor. What else can we see from Luke's side? He doesn't want to play the regional. He's thinking about playing. Oh, there it is. I think this is guard, the royal guards. But the problem is Luke has the initiative, so he's going to have to just drop his hand and then Boba can respond any way he wants. Boba got an amazing start there with the super laser. And then also getting... Uh, did he actually super laser? How is Luke ahead? Oh, is it because uh, Skywalker just never resourced? I don't know. I don't even remember Boba super lasering. Was that a resupply? I don't, I don't know how, how Boba got that, that far that quickly. <laughs> wow, nice, you lucky. 
I got all my Vaders and Boba from one case. Wow, yeah. Apparently, you did get lucky. Nobody was guaranteed that. All right, Viper is gone. Finally, with the power of the dark side. There's the there's the Basque. Oh my God! Right now, Boba's board is huge. Boba is putting eight damage onto Luke next turn. And Luke does not seem like he has any answer to it. Luke has not been able to add any resources. So Boba's just been uh, flowing a lot faster than the Luke. Even though Luke has green command and has green units, he just has not been able to find any of his super lasers the time he needed them. And so Boba is just flowing so much faster. Oh my god, there's the Royal Guard. This is going to be quickly answered with the Boba Overwhelming Barrage. Boba's acting like one of the best control decks right now. There it is. Boba's doing 11 damage this turn. No, that's actually 10 because he's 8. So there it is. 10 damage this turn. Okay. Okay, let's see how we're going to respond to this. Already Luke is struggling very, very fast. Luke is already at 14 HP, which is half his life. He does not want to be there, but he's already gotten there. He doesn't even have access to Luke this turn, so he's actually going to be struggling, guys. That's true. That's true, Cthulhu. <laughs> I feel you. All right, regional governor is called out. What are you going to play, a Boba Fett? Or an overwhelming barrage, maybe? Is what you're going to call out. I don't know if Boba Fett wants to actually get rid of the regional. But he can if he wants to. Regional X is a blocker though. Yeah, unfortunately, Luke Skywalker's hand is all to support Luke. But has nothing to really control board in any way. So right now, Boba Fett is going to deal another 8 damage. And potentially end game in one more turn. Power of the dark side is interesting. Wait, can we pull out Luke at 6? Okay, we actually can pull out Luke at 6, so never mind. So, at least we get a better flow here. We're going to play Overwhelming Barrage, I believe. Wow, we shot first. I don't know what that was. I think it gives you plus 3 in your attack. What was that card? Let me go look for it. Not sure with that. Oh, attack with a unit and give it plus three. Surprise strike. Holy moly. Huge. Huge removing that Skywalker. But then he took damage. So that's why he's, lo he's out of the leader position. He's back into the leader position, unfortunately. Let's see what we're going to do here. We got Grico. What's up, brother? Yeah, man. Are you going to be able to bring me the food or no, man? I, I can't go to the mosque right now. I'm busy. Okay, that's fine, man. I know I offered you $10 if you can get me some food, but that's fine. Man, if you can get some food from the mosque, I'll give you 10 bucks for two dishes. If not, that's fine, man. Just tell me right now. Don't make me wait. That's fine, man. It's okay. I just, I can't go. I want to go to the mosque. I just can't go right now. I don't have Hamad Siam's number, man. All right, I'll talk to you later, man. Yalla, yalla, bye. Caleb, Caleb just subscribed, man. Appreciate you for the subscription on YouTube. You guys need to follow me on YouTube because we are doing a lot of Star Wars content. We're still doing our Pokemon content, but we're going to do a lot of more Star Wars content, guys. Really strong play there. Darth Vader's best play, actually, is to bring out a Boba Fett in the Cunning deck. You can also bring out a Sentinel. 
Luke Skywalker here is going to be very strong. Uh, unfortunately, we cannot give him a shield, so he's going to be susceptible to taking these hits. Uh, I'm sure this is a turn that Luke Skywalker did not want to play out Luke Skywalker. This is a very bad turn. A lot of people on, on Twitch are watching us. Fanta fanatic for Star Wars, Cthulhu, you're the boss, man. Appreciate you. Bro, skipping moss for Star Wars, you're great, Manar. Bro, chill, man. What the hell? No, I, it's just that in the moss, they feed you. And because we, I'm fasting all day. And I just, I'm too busy, man. I just, I'm not, I'm not going to go there today. <laughs> the fanatic for Star Wars, man. Stop, man. I'm going to go to hell. <laughs> just for Star Wars. All right. Luke Skywalker has uh, five damage, but this is actually a problem. I think... We should have gotten rid of the Luke Skywalker. Even if he threatened removing our board, we still should have gotten rid of the uh, Skywalker in any way we possibly could have because we don't want to keep Skywalker on board, guys. Uh, I think the fast breaks in about 40 minutes. After this game, guys, stay tuned. Don't worry about me. Don't worry about me. I'll take a sip of water. I'm going to be fine. But we are going to look at the top 16, guys. So stay tuned. Don't run away. After this match, this is the finals, but stay tuned. After that, we're going to look at the top 16. Don't, don't run away. I'm staying here, especially if Cthulhu is sending me money. Hell yeah, I'm staying here. All right. Uh, oh, no! Luke Skywalker. Oh, I thought he was scooping. <laughs> Plays a home run. Plays a home run. Right? I'm going to find that card. Is that a home run? Guys, this is really bad. I wish, we, like, they did more graphics. But, I mean, I'm really thankful they, they streamed the event. But, you know, you just wish they, they did a little bit more. Um, but, me, I mean, I'm, I'm, that's just me being picky. Yeah, it was home one. Uh, each other friendly gets restore one. Play heroism from the discard pile. Cost three less. Um, let's see if he actually played it. I was looking for it, so I didn't see what he did. Plays home run and plays uh, the rebel. Really strong play there. Home run gains insane value. And uh, how are we going to do this? Are we going to be able to get rid of this? Oh, wait, 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 wait. How did we do that? What just happened? What was that card that he just played? Okay, it's the waylay. Return a non-leader unit to its owner's hand. Oh my god. <laughs> no! Oh my god! Oh my god, that waylay was so good! That's actually insane! You could waylay the Luke Skywalker with four shields! This is insane! Whaley is so good! I did not know that that's a real... F oh no, my god. Oh no, it's a non-leader unit. You could literally lay away the sc uh, Luke Skywalkers. My, my wife's a librarian at a local school, school here in the States. And she opened up the library for kids who are fasting to go to... Instead of going to the cafeteria. Man, you know what? Actually, I remember going to Heights High School for about a couple of months... And uh, that's what I used to do. I used to go, even without fasting, I used to just sit in the library. I don't know, I felt much safer. It was a much cooler place for me. I don't know, I liked hanging out next, next to the PCs and all the books. I don't know. That, uh, it was interesting to me. I was in that time really into manga. But yeah, <laughs> I, I hang out in the, in the library just for fun. Like, I, I, I did that all the time in high school. I was one of those big fat losers. I was such a fat loser that I didn't really have any good friends and uh, so I was just like always by myself I was so fat I was so weird my my parents just really failed in like giving me giving me like strength of character they really failed because I, my mom used to tell me my your dad never wanted you he he didn't even hold you like for the first two years so it makes sense I was always so weary I would ask all my friends do you like me do you like me I was so weird like that you know I had no self-confidence makes sense you know it, it's like a if you never got love from your parents when you're young, it's it's easy for you to not have self-confidence. But no, no, no. I mean, I don't care now. I'm a monster now. I'm a gangster. I don't even care about nobody's love. But like, I, I can tell. Like, I, I remember growing up, it felt weird. 
Guys, we have nine people watching us. I'm sorry to ruin your Pokemon card game adventures, guys, but this is more important than Pokemon. <laughs> Here are the finals, guys. Let's see how we're going to do. Final. I think Boba Fett is just so fast. The Luke Skywalker is just not going to be able to deal with it. Regional Governor is just not a strong card. I guess you could Regional Governor, the Darth Vader out of the game, or the Waylays. It's just so many, so many threats from Boba Fett's side that you just cannot play the game correctly. Another dollar. Thank you, my brother, for the struggle life. Been there, done that myself. My brother, I don't want you guys to feel pity for me. I just tell you my story so you can relate with me. No pity. Please do not pity me. I'm amazing. I'm so happy. I'm married. I'm strong. We're going to have kids soon. Uh, I'm very happy. God's blessed me, man. Don't, don't worry about me, man. There's a lot of people that are in need. I'm so happy. I'm blessed. I'm blessed. God's blessed me. I have eight people watching me right now on Twitch. I'm, I'm blessed. But uh, let's get back to the game. Boba Fett here with the ECL. He's not going to be using it. Not yet. Because the regional governor is not a real threat. But regional governor can shut us down. We can't use super lasers. That's actually big. If, 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 if the regional called out super laser, that's what you need to do. Nice subscriber. Thank God. Cthulhu is one of our first subscribers from the Star Wars uh, game. My brother. Thanks so much for the subscription. How do you convince your wife to stream or play cards so much? Bro. <laughs> That's funny to me that you actually worry about what your wife thinks. Your wife should worry about what you think. <laughs> Not the other way around. <laughs> My brother. Don't, don't ever feel like you should be worried about what your wife thinks. Ever. Always, always think of it, of it this way. Your wife is always worried about what she, you, you are thinking. Don't ever think you should worry about what your wife thinks because no matter what you do, if it's the, if it's, if you're solidified in that decision and you, you this is the decision you want to do, she's going to support you on it. She just needs you to be sure of it. Find the right chick. <laughs> That's very hard in America. Guys, we're, we're switching out from Star Wars. <laughs> we're about to become a, a freaking uh, a dating channel here. <laughs> Dating advice and marriage counseling. Oh no, Manar, don't go that road. All right, guys, let's see here. Boba Fett immediately. I really like what Boba Fett does. The second he sees the the blue Luke Skywalker is going to space, jumps into space. He sees him going to ground, plays some ground units. That's how you guys need to focus when you're playing the Star Wars meta. You're you're kind of uh, especially if you don't have the initiative. You just want to follow your opponent and kind of uh, figure out where he's going and, and try to not allow him to take full control over that area. Now, it's really easy for you to do that as red because you do can easily with Interceptor, for example, can take control over the space or even your raid, the other, the six cost raid one. That's extremely strong Can really anytime you want to play, it just takes control of space very quickly. So that's very easy in red, but in, in, in green and yellow, you need to be more careful. Immediately, you have to hop onto the side where you see there's more units. Now, I really believe it, it, this is signaling. Alex has no air space units. And yeah, you can tell that he has no space units because there's no reason for him to play another ground unit. He would have tried to follow along with, the, with his opponent and build on space. But unfortunately, like I told you guys, Cunning has some of the weakest space units. I mean, yeah, he does get stronger uh, during mid-game with the FET fire spray uh, or Spitfires. But uh, it just takes so long for the, them to come out. And, and also, Fitspires, you don't really want to trade with them. You want to get that damage out as soon as possible. Whereas Red likes to trade with their space units. They like to trade their space units out and it's really, really effective. Let's see how Luke Skywalker is going to do here. The initiative is on the other side. Unfortunately, J Alex just gives up on the space race and says, okay, listen, you got the space game. I literally cannot play against space. But what I'm going to do is I'm trying, I'm going to try to build up a big board on the other side or one big ground unit so I can actually over, uh, overwhelming barrage your space unit and, and, and kind of like hold you off a little bit. And there it is, overwhelming barrage is coming out. Oh no, that's a set fast... Steadfast Battalion ECL is the best play in the game right now with a Boba out. There's the... Ca ca oh my god, that's an insane play. Kanan is done. We, we, we keep one HP on our board and we deal three more damage to the base. One of the best ECL plays you could do in the game, really. Especially when you're a mid-game deck like a Aiden or a Boba. 
absolutely doable. Every single time you want to do it, you can do it. Uh, so they do the best three in those, correct? Should be a mutual thing always, but absolutely make sure both people have plenty of time to do their own passion of hobby. Help each other and enjoy life. Jesus, Boba, just too strong. Boba is just too strong, guys. Boba is too strong. He actually gave up on the space race. He just went for the Steadfast Battalion. That Steadfast Battalion took full control over the ground. And now even though Luke Skywalker is in base, I think uh, Boba is just too fast. There's a race happening right now, but we're seeing that Boba is going to win it. Boba is just did five damage with very small units. He has another 14 damage on board, whereas our op uh, his opponent only has, what, f six? First player to two wins right. Yes, absolutely. This is the best of three. There's no best of fives. And they didn't even cut down to top cut. So whoever had the best record immediately had the best record. They just didn't have time, which I really like. Oh my god, another Darth Vader. Overwhelming Barrage wins game. And it's really nice. We don't have uh, the initiative. Now we can Overwhelming Barrage anything important and win game. Another thing we could do is we can attack with the Steadfast Battalion, give plus two to itself, and then Overwhelming Barrage for nine damage on board. Or maybe we don't have to do that. We'll see. Cthulhu! Cthulhu and a lot of people actually called for the Boba win. So it's really surprising we see Luke Skywalker in the final, especially when he struggles so heavy against the Boba. That's crazy. Almost seems like Luke Skywalker has no answer to Boba. Do you guys agree? Because uh, Luke Skywalker has no way to reduce Boba's board except by trading. And at some point, Luke Skywalker's trades are just not as valuable. Because Boba's just uh, getting better cards. He has the e ability to, to e ECL to trade. He has, he has uh, more, more ways to gain uh, uh, resources. He has more ways to play out smaller units that give him more value. Luke is an odd piece. I did not expect to see him at the end table. Absolutely very surprising. Absolutely very surprising. Because I thought that Vader has a better matchup for Luke. So I would assume at least it would be Vader in the top tables versus the Boba. And and Vader has such a strong matchup against Boba that it makes sense. That, but uh, this is very interesting. Especially one of the big biggest tournaments with so many Bobas. To just see Luke get up there is huge. Because that means he literally had to battle so many different Bobas. <laughs> But also that could be another signal that this tournament was just one of the first Star Wars tournaments. A lot of people just got in here not knowing how to even play the game. And maybe that's why play, uh, basically the most, uh, it's not really the best leaders, the most, uh, the, the, the smartest players or the most experienced players were the ones with the advantage. Had nothing to do with leaders, maybe. We could say. All right, guys, that's going to be our final ad. Let's pay them. Let's pay them their dues. Our final ad for the day. Exciting day today. We watch amazing games. I'm still looking for the Palpatine. I haven't found Palpatine yet, guys. But the second I find the Palpatine, we're going to enjoy this a lot. I mean, I, I think Palpatine is one of the best decks. Now I understand Palpatine struggles against Sabine. Palpatine struggles against uh, Tarkin's. Palpatine struggles against the Inquisitors and, and Palpatine struggles against a lot of these aggressive decks. Really has no way to really deal with them in any strong way. But still against my Vader. Oh my god, I can't deal with Palpatine. It just forces me to play the game so differently because he can steal my big units. So I'm actually looking for that Palpatine. I want to get some inspiration. But let's get back into the game, guys. Boba, if he can do a little bit more damage, I think he's gonna get this. He's just done so much damage. He's already got his opponent at 15 to 19. Oh my god, there it is. 20 HP base. Final turn. Boba stands up his resources. Puts the Steadfast Battalion into the resource. And he's gonna go for the Darth Vader win. Correct? Or am I wrong here? Let's see here. Or if he can do plus one damage, if he can give that Boba plus one, 
He wins the game. Luke Skywalker didn't even pull himself out yet, guys. Luke Skywalker never was pulled out. He never deployed himself. There's a seven wing or a U wing. Sorry. Okay, there's game over. There's game over. There's a restore there. The restores is not enough. The restore is just not enough, guys. I think we restore one, but it's just not enough. Unfortunately. Very interesting. Bobo was able to just ignore the space and full, fully commit to the ground. Re recognizing Luke has no way to deal with this. There it is. 23 HP. One final. Greco attack wins the game. Luke Skywalker, what you got? This could be it. This actually might be it. No, no, you can't actually sell block. Oh, no, he doesn't have sell block. This is game over, guys. This is the final play. Luke, final plays. You wing reinforcements. I don't think anything in you wing reinforcements can save him. There's not a single card that he can find out there that could save him. I don't think. He can play down the Rebels, but they're just not going to save him here. What's he looking for? Uh, you would look for a Sentinel. Unfortunately, you can't. And even if he kills this unit, doesn't matter. Because we just attack with that second... Oh, we do have a Sentinel! Oh, wait, 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 wait guys. I actually messed up. I actually forgot. I think this is a Sentinel. That's true. This is huge. Unfortunately, we have the Darth Vader in hand. So he was looking for Sentinel. I actually thought there was no Sentinels in yellow. No, there is. There is Sentinels. There's the Darth Vader. It's going to get rid of that Sentinel, unfortunately. Now we need... Oh my god, we don't even have any more cards in the game. In our, our resources, guys. We don't have a single card in our resources. That means the second we take initiative, this is game over. Good game, guys. That was fun. No! No, 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 no. He's actually healthy. He's 30 HP. I keep forgetting. He's at 25 HP right now. He's at 30 HP. Okay, bounce and a sentinel. Yeah, that was huge, right? That was huge. Two bobas on table now. <laughs> Cthulhu's dream is happening. Two boba. Isn't boba your favorite deck? Isn't it your favorite deck? Luke, Luke Skywalker actually made it happen. He actually survived the turn that I did not think there was any way for him to survive. Partly not because he did not get to 25 damage. Because he did get to 25 damage. But it's actually partly because his base is so strong. Uh, first thing we do is we rely on the Alliant guys to play Obi-Wan Kenobi. That gives us... Is that a Sentinel? Uh, overwhelming barrage can win game or change of heart oh my god that's game over change of heart shoot i can't believe this bro cunning is just such a strong color yellow just has so many good uh cards now you are returning cards to the hand but you can return huge cards that just force the opponent to just resource him and basically that's you killing that unit it's huge i'm building that as my second deck i built sabine first because i'm i'm broke i believe it or not <laughs> believe it or not with all the money you got <laughs> good game there there we go the second the change of heart activated luke just had no way to come back from this and you're right cthulhu that was game over Okay, guys, uh, interested in your opinions. What do you think about that Luke Skywalker? Are you guys going to play Luke Skywalker or is it just Boba Fett all the way? Also, do you, is it Boba? F is it Luke or Vader? Which one is stronger? I think it's Vader. Just because you actually can deal with Boba Fett so much better. You actually can remove units. Whereas uh, Luke just was uh, for, was co totally controlled by the, by the Boba Fett, which is crazy. 
Weird that Luke made it there. Absolutely weird. I mean, he's strong. Don't get me wrong. A lot of people are not ready for these shielding tactics. A lot of people don't know how to play against it. So it makes sense that he got there. It's just that once you actually play against somebody that uh, recognizes the strategy, it's just really hard for you to get ahead.